and dreams for a great Nigeria through the various messages of Mamsa. The message in Quara was, we want justice, peace and unity in the land. The message was delivered by Professor Jerry Gana, a completely detribalized patriot who understands the intricate mechanics of social engineering. Let's take some excerpts from his speech in Quara. Nigeria will be down the line. Nigeria will be a strong nation. Nigeria will be a mighty nation. Nigeria will be the pride of Africa. We will want a solid economic foundation for democracy this time around. And it can only come if all our people do their work well. So we want to tell our people to all of you. If they are farmer, farm well. If they are carpenter, produce well. If you are a teacher, teach well. If you are a student, study well. If you are a counselor, counsel well. If you are a chairman, chairman well. If you are a market man, sell it well. And if you happen to be a governor, govern well. Hmm. Hopes and dreams for a better Nigeria 30 years ago. It's firmly on record that Mamsa succeeded in revolutionizing the political scene in Nigeria for a better stance. Let's now continue with the excerpts, Professor Jerry Gana. We are appealing to you that if all your colleagues do your work well, that is what is going to produce work in the nation, and Nigeria shall be left alive and strong and powerful to be able to redeem Nigeria and the rest of Africa. The final thing is the social foundation for the democracy. And in this matter of saying, let there be social justice in the land. Where there is no justice, there cannot be peace. Where there is still equality, there will be social unrest. Where there is poverty, there will be social unrest. Where there is injustice in the power, injustice in the labor, injustice in the mechanic, injustice in the agricultural power, injustice in the world. The Mamsa Trail strategized in a special way to bring the youths of Nigeria on board. The youths were involved. They became part of the Mamsa movement. And as a means to capture the youth for the Mamsa message, the rave of the day, Majek Fashek, was brought on board. At the time when the Mamsa Trail was going around Nigeria, the youth of that period who may then be in their 20s and 30s, are now in their 50s and 60s. This is a sad reality that will make you ask the question, are we moving forward or are we moving backward? <laughs> Now in the year 2019, we are still locked in a political quagmire. Why? Could it be that our political culture in Nigeria has now been toxified? There are more questions than answers. On stage here, that versatile musician, the one and only hilarious Majek Fashek, with his electric performance of Send down the rain. 